Hey, what's going on? It's Disco Doggy. Um, kind of in a rush right now, so I'm going to keep it somewhat, sh somewhat short. I um, I was messing around with some, some new teams, and uh, I thought that I had a good thing going here, and I lost my very first battle. And I'm pretty bummed because, I, oh god, I've just been loving the Prairie Mouse. Puddle Terror, it was performing excellently for me. Um, I haven't played it in a long time. And then the Frost Wolf Ghost Pup is just great right now. And I was thinking, I got something really awesome going. And I lost my first battle. I was so annoyed. Because, cause, I mean, I, 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 I can win with a Meadow Stomper, Meadow Stomper Calf. I can win with a Zandalari Raptor. And then I lose with a Puddle Terror. Come on, man. Come on. Um problem with the puddle terror is uh you know both of these moves really need speed to be effective both uh dive and bash or clobber excuse me and uh it was slower so let's see let's let's hope it won't happen again oh and speaking of slower we don't want that Leviathan Hatchling coming out and putting a Primal Cry on us. Or we don't want Bright Paw coming out and being the same speed as a Puddle Terror. Alright, well. So, I think what I'm going to do, if it, uh, let's see, what moves could it have. Well, for now, I'm gonna I'm gonna dive, and that way I'll miss the primal cry if that's what it has. Okay, it does, and then or the primal cry will miss me. And if it would have had whirlpool, I could have brought the, the the mouse in. So, so that was that was a good move. That was a good move. I'm glad I made a good move. Revenge will be ours. Although this wasn't the team that I lost to, so I lost to a bone serpent. Uh, wait, I gotta think about this for a second because this guy's got some crazy nuke action. Um, oh, I'm slower. Uh, what was I saying? I don't know what I was saying. I was talking about the team I lost to. So, uh, against this guy's, uh, Big big prowl. I was gonna use survival, but apparently I don't really mm -hmm. need to because he always already used the prowl and then the arcane dash, so it wasn't that big of a nuke. Oh yeah, Prairie Mouse is like my superstar pet these days. So let's see. Uh, what do I want to do? I'm gonna. Bring in this guy. Alright, so now I should just take him out. I think I'm just going to take him out before I can do anything except for swap. He swapped. Okay. Uh, oh, so what was I saying? I, was, I think I was saying what, what, what pet I lost. What pet I lost to a bone serpent. Um, a mechanical scorpid, and I don't really remember the other one, so at least not now. Maybe later I'll remember. Don't stun me, bro. Oh, thank god. That could have been disastrous. So I am in excellent shape here. I'm gonna go ahead and pass. And then the, the prairie mouse can do its thing. It can start off with the survival. You know, I'm, uh, uh, sometimes at the beginning of a, a face off like this, well, okay. He did that. I wasn't expecting that. Someone, you know, you get so used to people like not knowing what they're doing that 
when they do it gets like <laughs> i was gonna say it gets annoying it doesn't get annoying but you're just like oh okay you know what um just to be safe here do i need to do that no i'm i'm, I'm gonna i'm gonna win this no matter no no let's be safe Let those let those tick. And there we go. Revenge is truly mine. Not really, because I'm not fighting the same team. So how how are you gonna get revenge if it ain't the same team? Um Really, I have to say, I made I made a mistake in this first... Not, not this battle. I probably made a mistake in this battle, too. But, you know. Uh, in the other one against the Bone Serpent, I, I, uh, I get so used to... Bone Serpents being slower. And I forget, there's actually a 292 speed Bone Serpent. And the only thing that it really has going for it... Is it can surprise people like me who would never ever take a 292 speed bone serpent so yeah <laughs> it, it worked against me apparently I have problems looking at uh, the speed of my enemy pets let's see let's start off by looking at the speed of our enemy pets oh okay well Well, well, and well. Okay, let's start with the prairie mouse. Oh, really? That's what you're going to do? Because it's a good idea. What the hell's up with people playing well? I mean, they, they, sh they, shouldn't, they shouldn't be doing that. Trunk's pretty powerful. It's actually a, a good complement to... Uh, the double AOE here. Well, it's actually a, a, a triple with trunks, but um, it's a good complement to the uh, two undead pets because it's got that strong attack against the critter. Not a bad pet. Super slow, but you don't bring it because of its speed. You bring it because of its power and its moveset. So... That was a good call, starting with the uh, starting with trunks. So let's see, how do I want to play this now? I don't want the FOA to come out and stun me. Okay, that's good. I'm glad. So graves. If I do a haunting song now, Will it, uh, what's this, 222, something like that, 223, um, I think I'm going to be okay, but do I want to do it now, or do I want to try to take Graves down, I think I'm going to go ahead and do it now, I don't know, something, something told me like, mm, you should just kill Graves as fast as you can, probably because I don't want his, um, his, uh, moves to reset so that little uh that little pet battler voice inside of me was absolutely correct i should have not used my haunting song i don't know i don't know okay so let's see the question now becomes do I want to use my bash against this guy, use my clobber, or do I want to wait until I'm facing the FOA? Well, I brought this guy, so I'm going to use it. The other choice would have been to bring in my prairie mouse, and that way he's going to take weak damage at the back. Um, I made my choice. Let's let's hope it was the right one. Okay, well I don't think I'm gonna be able to get another bash off. I s 
swap a survival I survive mm. so it's really gonna be about now will the uh, shit it's gonna be a draw man unless no it's not no it's not okay I got this that was a close one not well played by me but well I don't know if, if I, I should say it wasn't well played by me or not um, the, the the thing is uh, I wonder if I would have been better off bringing the mouse in and just just taking the back line damage against graves against bone storm and then you know put the DOT up I don't know and and then let the let the let the puddle terror come in and bash it might have been a better better play to do it that way but I want I, you know it's always good to win revenge will be mine <laughs> no uh let's see so I really wanted to go do something else. Um, maybe, maybe I will call it quits now. I know it's 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 been like a whole week, and now I'm only doing two battles. What the hell? What the hell, dude? Two battles a week. Um, you know, I, I've I've actually been pet battling a lot. I just I just haven't been, I just haven't been recording it. I mean. Um, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I'm actually into other stuff too. So uh, I mean, like, I'm pretty excited about some other things I have going on right now. Like, I'm getting back into music. I always talk about trying to get back into music, but I'm actually getting into like I'm like mixing records regularly again, and it's like super fun. And I'm like doing like little mini edit mixes on on an MPC 1000, and um, which I wish I could do them on my SU-1000. I'm sorry, my SU-700, this old Yamaha machine that not many people use, but it was super cool for, like, remixing and edit mixes. But it's, anyways, you know what? If I have time to talk about that, I have time to do one more battle. So um, let's do it. So, yeah, all I'm saying is I'm excited about some things right now. Life is good. Oh, my God. This player, I got I to gotta be smart here. Um, jeez, and the the this guy here. Oh man, why did I play another battle? No, I'm just kidding. Uh, I don't know what to do about that dire horn. I don't know what to do about that dire horn. I just don't. So head game right off the bat. Is it going to rush me because it knows I have clobber? This player's decent. I've played this player before. Or is it going to do its primal cry? Okay, it's going to do its primal cry. So that is good. So that's going to allow me to... Well, that is good. Things are starting off in my favor. But you never know what's going to happen to you against a dire horn. Maybe, they, maybe they're not familiar with the, the puddle terror. Jeez. I think I got it. I think I did well against this player. Nice. Well, against the Dire Horn at least. I mean, th th this is this team is no joke. It's beaten me quite a lot. So if you're someone who's out there and Okay, let me shut up now because Here's what I'm going to do. Ah, I'm, I'm in a bit of a bind here. What do I do? What do I do? Uh, that guy's going to take a lot of damage if I can't heal it, but I really want the mouse to take down the flurry, but I'm choosing to heal my mouse instead. That is the choice I'm going. I'm sorry, to heal my Puddle Terror, because a Puddle Terror is not going to survive... Um, too much like too much of that so now I'm gonna take this flurry down and hit this guy so let's see where does that leave my puddle terror 
Oh, I probably should have just kept the ghost pup in. Okay. This is fine. All right, you know what? The puddle terror might die. Um, I'm not going to try to do any swapping. I think I'm in good enough shape here. Um, I think I'm okay. Okay, yeah, we're good, man. We're good. Okay, so we are going to end up with a head game against the, um, the Fragment of Anger right now. So, so here's my choice. Wait, what's a two, what's 231 crit? Is that going to... You know what, I'm not going to take any chances. I'm doing well enough. Okay, good. I... I I won that head game too. Alrighty. I beat this player. Which is, I beat this good team. As anyone knows. Well, geez, I gotta be careful. I can't get too cocky too soon. But as. No, nah, I think I'm fine. Um, as anyone knows, a dire horn is a critter's. Oh shit. If, if, if I get crit here. Oh, come on. That would completely suck don't completely suck don't completely suck pet battles oh thank god pet battles don't completely suck all right so all right yeah so as anyone who's ever played a critter knows direhorn is your worst enemy so um you know uh, when you win a game like that it's like Wow, I played so well. But, you know, there were a couple of head games in there. And, I mean, how do you really play a head game well? I mean, it's kind of it's kind of funny. Like, if you think about competitive pet battling and PvP pet battling, um, you end up with head games. I guess you end up with head games in, in any game um, that, that has RNG in it. Um, or, or maybe even any game. I don't know. So uh, the, the, the point I'm trying to make is you could say, Oh, wow, great game. I played super well. I just had to make some guesses based upon the other player and what I thought the other player would do. And it turns out I guessed right. So with that, I'm going to call it a night. And um, good for me, good for my prairie mouse, good for revenge will be ours. And I'm going to add that um, win right now here let me just do it so no one has to remind me about it so have a pleasant week i'll try to be back before next wednesday